everybody. Welcome to the Dad Challenge Podcast. My name is Josh. Thanks for joining me today. I'm getting a little bit sick. Everybody in the house has got the stupid cold. It's like a little bit of a thing. and So I'm looking all cozy. That's why I'm looking like this. Mm, it's a nice sweater. Anyway, today we're doing a Doherty Dozen Snarkity Day 2 of the Doherty D's Nuts December or whatever. <laughs> I'm like behind. Just, okay, I'm on the prep video today. Then they go to New York. I don't know. I don't know if we have time. She's got so much to snark on. I'll try my darndest because I want to get to other people too. There's like, I want to talk about Oscar and Kira. Man, you got Crazy Pieces came out with another damn video. I got so much to snark on. So damn, I'm going to have to get to it all. Um, but as you know, if you're a member or Patreon of this channel, you get to be put on the wheel for the entire month of December. Okay. And on Friday, I'll do double so that only the high tier members will get on the wheel and they have a better chance of winning. So let's dance. Let's get to the snark. It's a long video today. So I'm going to try to cut right through the garbage. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Reach out to me, Josh, at the Dad Challenge Podcast.com. It's your size and your address, and I'll hook you up. Let's go. And news update. You're getting in an update. Breaking. Dockety Dozen has finally blocked me on TikTok, so I had to start like four new accounts. I don't understand why these people think that blocking me is going to do anything. <laughs> idiots um it's funny though because if you look at her tiktok tiktok is actually a place where idiots get way more support youtube seems to be like the platform for people who have their brain in their head sort of not all of them but a lot more like she gets way more negative comments on her youtube videos and tiktok they're like yes queen all the way slay hey you know feed your kids utter bullshit it's it, it, you love them you feed them meals it's so stupid. Anyway, she gets way more hits on TikTok than she does. Just in her New York trips, she's over 2 million on half of them. Like, it just, she travels and it gets millions of hits. So these kids get to travel, but they have to do it for content creation. They don't get to travel for, they don't get to travel for vacation. They have to create content. And I showed you that video of them running through the airport the other day, and Nevaeh looking like she doesn't want to be there at all. And then I showed you the thing that Nevaeh put out, someone sent it to me. Someone had like messaged me in a DM and saying, why are you looking up Nevaeh on Snapchat? I don't look these kids up, everybody. People send me these things. How, how do you not understand that? I don't have time to be looking for everything. Okay, if I did, these videos would be way better. <laughs> but people send me these things all day. I get literally hundreds of messages a day, specifically about Doherty Dozen. So I'm not out there searching for these things. And if one of the kids were to reach out to me, I wouldn't even have them on this channel. I wouldn't even speak to them. I'd be like, I'm not the person you need to be speaking with. Unless they have to be like, I, I feel like I'm in danger and you're the only person I can reach out to. Then I'd have kind of a duty to like do what I can. But I'm not reaching out to these kids, not looking for their comments. I'm not going to do any of that. Not until they're of age anyway. So that's not what I'm about here. And these kids are victims all the way through and through. So I hope you guys remember that, all right? Don't be stupid. Anyway, here we go. New York prep. So there's two of these videos. One pair, everybody's like, don't even bother watching it. It's bullshit. But each of them are over two hours long of her putting suitcases and shit together. So I am definitely scrubbing through this bullshit. And I'll probably miss all the big ones I get. Oh, well. Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Dockerty Dozen. White claws and coffee and donuts for dinner. McDonald's all day, she'll get it delivered. Doing the laundry like once every spring. These are a few of Lush's favorite things. Pam's overries and spaghetti table noodles. Eyeliner floor fries and snarkity doodles. Feeding your kids like pure diabetes. These are a few of Lush's favorite things. When the haters like DCP make their videos She simply deletes all the negative comments And then she won't feel so bad Okay, that was the, that was the hardest song to rhyme to, like 
Get wrecked. Sound of music. And this is a day in the life of a mom to 12 kids the day before we leave for vacation. Let me guess. Let me guess. A bit That's a protein shake. <clears throat> but first, coffee. I don't believe you. That's a lot of coffee, lady. Chill. Oh, <laughs> you like? <laughs> you know that's gross, right, Alicia? You know it's nasty that you do that, right? Okay, just wondering. We are taking our twelve kids to New York City tomorrow. Uh, I still have so much to do. To Why don't you get one of your twelve children? most of which you are really capable to help you. <laughs> Anybody ever heard of that? Day to prepare for that. F off. On top of, you know, all of the kids' regular stuff going on. Um, so yeah. Miguel's coming at 7 a.m. Yeah, okay. Okay, do you want me to pick out clothes for you or do you want to do it? Yeah. Yeah. Why don't you, no. You pick your clothes out and get ready. <sighs> Do you want to shower after your haircut and just stay in jammies for now? Yeah. Okay. Then we'll wait. Even their dressers and shit are just utter bullshit. Those are made of, like, paper. I don't get it. This woman will spend five to six to seven thousand dollars a month on just bullshit groceries, but her children don't have dressers. Smart. She's real smart. She has a full day of school, but I have to take her for that COVID test for her surgery next week. What? You have to take her for a COVID test a week before you take her for surgery? What, what use is that? She could get COVID between now and then. It should be 24 hours before your surgery. What surgery? You want to go to school until nap time? A little bit of school? No. You say you're going to school. You don't, you don't let your kids choose whether or not they go to school? Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. I'm debating if it's worth the hassle of drop off and take off. Oh my God, it's a two hour video. And it's literally, she probably just puts, press record and walks around for two hours. For a couple hours. Oh. You don't want to go? You going to stay home? It's a paper plate there, bruh. Oh, they were watching, um,. What's it called? Hotel Transylvania. Here is my over... Carry-on outfit. Carry-on outfit. Met shirts, Nick shirts, picture outfits, Rockettes outfits. I love New York City. So these kids don't get to wear anything. So they have all these clothes that you buy for them. All their really nice clothes. And yet when you travel, you buy them brand new clothes so they have to match. What what a wasteful disgustoid you are. Tractor supply achieving list that I'm hoping to accomplish today. So that'll be done. I don't know if lunch is going to happen. It's not going to happen. That's why you bought clothes, because you didn't want to do laundry. Isn't Imagine this. Imagine you're so lazy, you don't want to do laundry, but you just buy your kids new clothes anyway that they're just probably going to throw in the garbage. All right. We made Rice Krispies yesterday. That's why that's all done. Okay. A little late now. The mice already ate all the shit. We've got more cereal in the garage pantry. I'm, I believe you. Look at, there's not only Rice Krispies, uh, the only cereal in that whole line right there that's probably worth eating. Everything is pure, unadulterated garbage and sugar. Those are nearly empty. Most of the kids are home for lunch today because of the half day, so I decided they're going to eat leftovers for lunch so we can try and clear out the fridge before we leave. Um, sure. <laughs> Good morning. I always come out to their lockers, grab their backpack. Um, let's see what sh So there, this is apparently another thing that she copied from Just the Bells, which is another vlogger, uh, adopted large family vlogger. Um, they got lockers and then Alicia got lockers. So she copies everybody. That she just nothing Alicia does is ever original. Even her TikToks are all like, "Oh, I gotta copy someone else is doing this." It's all about trends. Nothing she comes up with is original, shoes. except for her thumbs. Who's can Jason wear? Oh Jason my Ford's God! Shoes, a sauce, a bag of chips. It's like Halloween candy back here. Jason takes What is that? Two packs of fruit snacks, just candy. Candy and chips. Here you go, enjoy it! 
Here's your Comic Sans backpack. Sans bag, so far I've got Jordan and Jason. He's got a sweatshirt from yesterday. Stop it! Holy your thumbs. The stuff of nightmares. So yes. It'd be so much easier to do your job if you had two hands, isn't it? It was like, you're such a hard worker. Well, she'd get it done faster if she had two hands to work with. Today I had so much stuff come from Amazon that they left the delivery box with me. They've done this before. And then I empty it and I leave it outside for them to pick up the next day. Nice flex. I order so much shit from Amazon, they have to drop it off on a pallet. Where do you put all this stuff, Alicia? Do you have no room in your house? It's already disgusting. Where are you putting all this garbage? You must throw so much shit in the garbage. Hello. Ew. Maybe you should clean your makeup off. Ew. Uh, that's why you're not looking good. Ugh. Run up and quick make the bed. Josh apparently has a pregnant pillow. <laughs> or he puts the wall up because he doesn't want to see her when he wakes up in the morning. Oh yeah, I'm married to her. Damn it. He wakes up from a good dream. He's like, oh yeah, this is my life. Shit. <laughs> They just leave the, the fans on, noisemakers on. I'd put a pillow up wall up too. You know what I'm saying? Don't touch me. I made the bed, but there's a huge pile of shit in the corner. So the kids got all brand new backpacks too, even though they have brand new backpacks downstairs. Why couldn't you just use their backpacks from school? Good question. Good question. Because they apparently need 10 backpacks a piece for some reason. And the ones from school look like they're even bigger than those ones. She knows the Comic Sans is bullshit, too. She knows it. Can you imagine being a 17-year-old going to high school with a Comic Sans backpack? You get your ass kicked for that. All right, dragging over the Amazon box. Look at this. We are looking at it. You got the camera right on your chest. We got it. Yeah, creepy weirdo. Okay. So put some weight on it. That would have been really bad. Um, I'm gonna make my and this is our old Christmas tree that I'm going to bring to the twins' biological family. Oh, you're such a sweetheart. Here's a broken tree. Enjoy it. Yeah, we got a better one. It does have a top to it. It's just right there. Oh, yeah. It was outside for a while. There just might be a raccoon in there. I'm on break. How's it going? Fantastic. Get a shirt to fit, Stan. I'm in the house of royalty right now. I've already had two classes, and kids are getting caught up. Nice. I'm making a difference. Maybe you should make a difference in your own family's life. I don't know. Be present there. Just saying. Burn. I'm proud of you. <laughs> I'm proud of you. You don't need to work. We make millions. But you do because I... You need to be away from me. I get it. There are like TVs on in the other room and it's like just on. Nothing's connected to it. It's just on. Just on. You imagine their freaking hydro things like... <laughs> I've not cleaned that counter yet. Let's ignore that. Yeah, you don't clean anything, gross head face. <laughs> it makes a difference. Bye. Love you. See you at lunch. Leave. It was lunch, ass hat. What? All right. Don't dance. You don't know. All right, let's get this counter clean. You're a piece of gross. Just to sear this, but look at how giant this is. This is not going to fit in the pan to sear. So we're just going to put it in the crock pot and like put some stuff in. And Hear that again. So here's what she does. Here's what you're supposed to do to make a delicious meal. But I'm not going to do the thing to make the delicious meal. I'm just going to skip it, put a bunch of shit in the crock pot, and no one's going to eat this $85 piece of meat. Because it's gross. Because I didn't make it properly. Because I don't seem to give a shit about anything else. Well, I'm going to make a version of Dr. Pepper pulled pork. Um, what? See. The waste. The waste. I don't have time to wash dishes tonight, so we're putting this in the dog box. You don't have time to wash dishes any night. Ew, what the hell? The heck is... all day. That seems gross mm -hmm. and full of sugar. Pork. He's like, ugh, no thanks. He didn't sear it. That doesn't make any sense. And all the spice you put on just washed off. 
There's no way that tastes good. Does it taste good? I'm gonna cook this. I'm gonna slice COVID test. I can't get her to do it. Josh is gonna have to do that on his yeah. lunch break. Um, Underwear. Yeah, that I gotta run to Target. Chat this oh, You can do that. Yeah, I can do that at the same time. Okay. I don't understand. What the hell is that tractor supply? So the chickens or something? Here's a question too. Someone wrote in my comments. She went and bought like 85 eggs at the grocery store, but she has chickens. Do you not have the chickens for the eggs or the chickens to eat? Let me update you where I'm at in the packing process. It's almost noon. And right now I'm working on getting two outfits for each person. One is going to be in going for four days. Their carry on in their backpack. And one is the outfit they wear Saturday evening, which can just be any old regular plain comfy clothes, doesn't matter. Um, because over here are the rest of our outfits. Oh my God. Look how much she bought for them to wear, even though they have clothes, because they have to match. Could you imagine? No thanks. Look, I've done the family vacation shirts. We all wear the one day you leave, that's it. You don't ever have to wear it again. It's just for nostalgia, for fun, for memories. I don't make my kids wear the same damn thing on vacation everywhere. That's ridiculous. That's stupid and silly. We have our Christmas picture outfits and the pic the outfits we're going to see Music Man in. We have, well, buried under there are what we're wearing for dinner Friday night. This is what we're wearing to the Knicks game. This is what we're wearing to the Mets stadium. And these are what we're wearing to the Rockettes. So she just told you, and I don't know if she released this before she went to New York. Where? Well, and she's still in New York. She just told you everything she's doing while in New York, which is why she's taking security, which she doesn't need to. I mean, they'll be fine because no one, she thinks she's more famous than she is. The security at their home, I can see that because of what happened at their house. But New York City? I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's true. Maybe New York City is just full of crime and it's probably better to take security. I don't know. I'm kind of torn because New York City is a crime-ridden cesspool. So I kind of b agree with her on that. But first, I have a wax appointment. Ooh. I didn't want to visualize any of that shit. You take it back. I am done. Oh, your eyebrows. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Ready to go. Ah, uh, uh, they made them thin, like the 90s. Uh, now I'm dropping this off, which just worked out perfectly because I made this appointment the other day. And it's like, she was like, because I'm. I gotta drop this off, it's right here. Why are you lighting it up like you're in a Ferrari, lady? Relax. It's a damned cube van. And Josh couldn't do anything? Okay, thanks, Josh. Yeah. This all gotta get packed. And this is the thing that came from you. Our million subscriber. I got one of those 100,000 ones right there. But we're gonna wait and open that later because I gotta make a whole video about all the subs I bought. That is a whole family award. We are gonna open it as a family. Um, Sorry, I just rushed in here. You're fine. I'm just packing for a trip. Let's take all the help I can get. So then why don't you ask people for help then, asshole? You have 12 kids! They can do their own bag! Here's your shit, put it in your bag! Here's your shit! What else shit do you need? Breakfast at the airport. Look at the waste. Is she pulling the shit out of the plastic bags? And then putting them in plastic bags? I'm calling Greta Thunberg, and she's gonna come to your house and say something like this. You have stolen my dreams and my childhood with your empty words. How dare you? Because you deserve it. My God, look at how much she just sits here for hours. Come the cookies, get the cookies. Is she packing cookies in the suitcases? I mean, you gotta pack a snack, I get that. I understand that. Don't you sing, you son of a bitch. How about an apple? Can we get a yapple in there? How about a yapple? Yapples are good. Banana? I gotta go pick up the meds before the pharmacy closed. Hey, can someone else go pick up the meds? Please, I'm hissy in here. If I did this to my wife, I would be castrated. I would be castrated. What is Josh doing? Okay. And while I still have Erica here. Oh, Erica's there. Where's Josh? Running more errands. Pink 
goodness, Erica came over today. Thank you. You pay her to be there, so yeah. It's her job. What does it smell like? Chinese food? What did you eat? What the hell is that supposed to mean? I can't believe this bullshit, man. I can't believe it. Dollar spit. I don't need anything at the Target dollar spot. I just like to look. You don't need anything from anywhere. All right? You don't need to buy more shit from any place on earth. You have more shit than most people on earth. Mm. Didn't she just buy makeup the other day? What is that? Skin loving ingredients. Camo cream. The cover up? I don't cover up as I have some of that right here somewhere. Boom. Whenever I have a zit. I don't know how to use it though. I don't have one of those dabbers. I use paper towel. <laughs> You trying to look like an elf or something? This is elf in makeup? I'm just trying to go through this one because we gotta do it in sequence, everybody. She's just buying... Nah, I should not buy more headphones. You buying more damn headphones? How many pairs of headphones these kids have each? Oh my god! Every time they travel, they get new headphones! Oh my god! Is this the right kind? They're headphones, sure. dumbass. If your kids have iPhone 14s, no, they're not the right kind. Unless you have a lightning adapter. So no, there's no headphone jack in their phones. James with me. Anything Bluetooth will work though. You dingleberry. I, I don't, I don't know. What do you mean? What are you looking for? Okay, I, I guess I'll get these and then I need to- She doesn't even know what she's looking for and she still gets it. Doesn't even care, doesn't make a call. Hey James, what do I get? They have phones, you can call them, but she's on the phone. Filming! Sweet. Uh, you can literally buy any USB-C charger for a Switch. You don't need to buy the $50 one. You moron. The amount of money she wastes just hurts me in the soul. Right in my, right in my sphincter. Okay. Or, hear me out, if you lose your shit, too effing bad, kids, learn. I'm debating, do I get a stroller for Harley? You don't have a stroller? You had 12 kids, you have a stroller in your house somewhere in that pile of garbage? Hmm. <sighs> you know what you do when you travel with kids? You get a fold-up wagon and get them at Costco. They're really nice. They fold really nicely and they do. you can do a gate check with them. Put a gate check bag on the go-in. When you get out, Westy sits in his wagon. I pull the damn wagon. You can put bags and shit in there. Snacks. Everything in the fold-up wagon. That fold-up wagon has been a miracle for us. I took it to Mexico. The best thing I ever brought with me anywhere. And it folds up really small. Get a folding wagon. You don't need a stroller. Because it's like you can haul things too, right? A stroller, you can't really haul things. Just put a kid in it. A wagon, boom. Yeah, we're good. Of course you are. Of course you are. Because you're a wasteful piece of garbage face head. Burn. One more stop, I'm gonna swing into Walgreens and- You son of a bitch. You do not need to go to another store. Stop going to stores! You just spent two grand at Target, you spent 15 million dollars for this trip, and now you're going to Walgreens for what? You have snacks already! Just kidding, I'm not that angry. Basin and look for a hair straightener. Target didn't- At Walgreens. Have it, and- Dash sat on my hair straightener and broke it this week. Okay. I. Uh, how are you this big on YouTube? What happened? Do you know somebody there? Like, do you have an uncle that works in there? And they're like, I'll make you famous. How does this shit get fans? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shut up! So, <laughs> bought this, like, weird one from Target, and it did this to my hair. That's not straightened. And it's maybe you. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's eyeliner, face, head, hair, nose. This is not, this is not my look. So. I just realized 
Alicia and I have very similar noses. I have more of a bulb, though. See the bulb? She is more of like a bulb, you know? I have a big... This is the native in me, 100%. And the fact I have no hair in my legs. But she has... We have very similar noses, I noticed. Schnazes. I used to like my nose, but now I'm getting older, shit's growing. And I have hair in my ears. Where the hell did that come from? Let's go see if Walgreens has a hair straight. Oh, I'm sure you're going to get three carts of shit while you're there. If you get three carts of shit, I'll be pissed. Because she'll walk in and she'll be like, oh, I need all these things that I don't need. Okay. You are a dumb head. Here. Get, uh, there's a million other kinds of makeup. Why do you have to get Elf? What's so good about Elf? I'm telling you, anything else makes me break out except Elf and Mary Kay. So get Mary Kay or whatever. I don't know. Olay and some rodent in field. So you're saying 15 different kinds of makeup don't make you break out. Got, got it. Got it. Elf. Yes. Do they have 150? Yes, they do. Oh, stop. Stop it. Yeah. I hope you trip and hurt your knee or something. Okay. So. This is the one I got. This was all Target. That's not a straightener, dumbass. It's got a twist in it. So it'll twist your hair. Right? Twist. It's called twist and curl. Had. Don't get it. Well, clearly, look at you. So. She's so stupid. She's like, okay, you broke my flat iron or whatever it's called. Flat iron. And so I'm going to go get something that's not a flat iron. And then it's not going to work. And I'm going to throw, you know, $30 in the garbage and then go get a different one. Out what, what a I total want. dumbass. Uh, get the one that's on sale. You have thin hair. Of course, no, get the most expensive. <laughs> I want the most expensive one. This one. Eh? Yeah. Or should I get the skinny one? I don't know. Just get the damn flat iron. I also need... See, she, I also need millions of other things. Hairspray. It's not the 80s. Do you put hairspray when you straighten your hair? Does it keep it straight or something? Oh my god. Like Just thing. get it! Like it Aquanet or some shit. Story time, ready? I grew up in the 80s and 90s, okay? I was born in 79, so I grew up like, you know, I knew the 80s pretty well. When I was in like grade 5, 6, my sister was pretty popular when she was grade 7, 8. Very popular, actually. And she would wear, you know, I told you guys about the rolled pin pants and like the fashion, the Vornay France and the Club Monaco sweaters and the big ass hair with the Aquanet. Her friends would come over in the morning to get ready for school and the amount of hairspray in that house. If you lit a match, I kid you not, the house would be in space. So much hairspray. I'm pretty sure they're dead now because they just inhaled so much hairspray. Crazy amount of hairspray in the 80s. That's where the hole in the ozone came from. High school girls in the 80s. I, 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 hairspray's like, oh, Frizz Connect and, you know, Shape Shifter and freaking Curl Bomber. It's all the same shit in the bottle. They just put a different title on it. It's the same bullshit, okay? It's, it's glue for your hair. I can't believe she bought headphones for these kids again. I cannot believe it. Do they just throw them in the garbage when they're done? I don't even get it. What the hell? Why has... AirPods and knows how to use them. I have AirPods and don't know how to use You have AirPods and you bought another set of Bluetooth headphones? It works the same. You, Oh my God. You take your AirPods, okay? These are my wife's, okay? You put that shit up to your phone and it says connect AirPods. It's literally what it does. Yeah, dumbass. I gotta get the suitcases out. Guarantee these shits are gonna be orange. <laughs> Yes! Yes! Ew, why is your color orange? I, orange is the worst color. Like, it's good for Halloween, that's it, okay? Orange anywhere else, no go. Nobody wears orange. Tom does, but. Like, storage wise. Um, yeah, I can just set them on the back. Thanks. Open it! Open it! So, like. Oh, nesting, I see. Su suitcase instead of a suitcase. Don't sing, because you can't. Okay? You can't. And you're silly. 
and your damn shirts with all the patches. At this point, she's just trolling. That's fine. At least I know she's watching. Okay. So there's the I wonder if show when she watches my videos, does she laugh? Do you think she laughs? I mean, when I'm laughing at Josh burning the turkey, you know she's laughing. When I'm when Nana's like turn, you know, and I'm yelling at Nana, you know she's laughing, right? She's paying. She's probably paying lawyers right now to go through every one of my videos, so they could like find shit to like get mad at me for. And the lawyers who are going through my videos are probably laughing their ass off. And like we are getting paid to laugh at our clients. You're welcome, lawyers. Ding. Oh, Josh is home to do nothing. Hey, I'm home. Do you need anything? No, I'm done already. Well, <laughs> that's good. So they're staying in your room? Josh's like, I've tied a bag. My work here is done. I'm going to go sniff my dick and have a beer. Oh, my God, this guy. So that's another thing people commented. They have two rooms in New York. I mean, I hope these rooms are like 10 beds in each. I stand at a hostel. Where are they staying? Two hotel rooms? Where are these kids? Are they all like, I don't understand. Are you staying at an Airbnb? I don't get where they're staying. Because there's like, I think they're taking 20 people with them, including two security, which they have to pay for hotels and some family. I think Pam's ovaries and her daughter are going. So I don't know what's going on. And these are the spare outfits. One of those has dog poop in it, though. So be careful. So wow, you guys are real connected. So dumb. Just put it in bags. When you get there, we'll sort it. Wait. This guy hates his life. Yeah, I'm just gonna pack all the extra spare clothes. This is so easy. Oh, no, it's not even at all. It's easy because you didn't do shit, bro. <laughs> you wanker. Sarcasm, everybody. Oh, okay. Got it. Sarcasm. He's talking to me. <laughs> hey, Josh. What's up, bro? You're not my bro. You're a dish. Delicious. We've been working days at this. I mean, don't If you were just organized, it wouldn't take you days. And if you just said, hey, kids, I need you to pack two outfits, leave them on your bed, I'll come grab them. Boom. Done. Two hours. Done. It's bullshit. You, you're so bad at this. You have no business having 12 kids because you're so bad at it. Yeah, one side is for spare clothes and the other side is for socks and underwear. I mean... Does it really matter? They're going in the same bag. I can figure that out. Yeah. Chill. Has their names on. Yeah, but... Like, you're not... What are you complaining about? This isn't... This. You're terrible. This is garbage. His system's already better than yours. It'll just be, like, easier. No, it won't be easier. It's not going to be easier. You made this shit dumb. I think they'll all fit in one layer, and then we can pack the other half, especially in yours. But this will separate it out. Trust me, it's going to make things easier. You're stupid. We don't need our spare. They're underwear for me. So you need unmatchable. Uh, the more you go down the, the rabbit hole of the more you down the worm hill of Dr. And he dozen, the more you realize that she absolutely thrives on a few things. Okay. Spending frivolous amounts of money because she gets dopamine hits. Everybody need, and she absolutely thrives where, and when everybody relies on her for everything, she needs them to need her. It's really, really telling. Who's on the right? Who got yeah. Super Mario headphones? Yeah, I'd be like, everybody already has. But what about the 10 pets, pairs of headphones we already bought them? That's what I'd be asking. I want a pair. You're a douche. Just kidding. You're not. Just kidding. Ooh, look at these boots. iPads? Uh, iPads should be charged and dashed. Everybody has an iPhone 14 and you're bringing iPads. Why? Because the switch is charging right now. And switches. Holy shit. Dang! And you're going to New York with all that stuff? Okay, be safe. What about your guys? Patrick could take your switch. Who said that? Dash. I never said yeah, that. Yeah, I didn't think so. Didn't think it doesn't so. work anyway. So it doesn't. That's what he said. Yeah, no. It doesn't even work. The kids broke it. Oh. I'll have to buy another one then. So. Do you want to? You, you want me to charge your AirPods? I didn't charge. I don't know how to use them anyways. You literally have a kid right here who can show you how to use them, you dumbass. Just ask for help. That's really telling. She can't even ask people for help. It's like something wrong with her brain. Okay. I you can play this yellow one. And then Alex is going to be like, oh, I can help you. What? 
Okay, so I gotta make sure everybody's phones and stuff is charged. Okay. Yeah. Just and the man needs to eat dinner. Okay. Um, Are your hands down your pants? Um, and we have to have a family meeting. Is she scratching her butthole? And what? open our <laughs> book pack. What? Uh, what did he say? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, and then we have to have a family what? meeting and what? open our book pack. <laughs> I knew this was on the Reddit. That kid just said, what the F? Really, really loud. What? Uh, what? What did he say? Yeah, you got it. Uh, no, Josh, like, yeah, he said that what you think he said. Uh, yeah, <laughs> guys, you guys got... What? what is he doing? See, there's the calculation. Why did she come up and stop the video, but keep it in? I don't understand her logic here. Why did you cut it? You kept it in because you knew we were going to talk about it. Your kid's saying, what the F? Who's like, what, six? My kids would never do that. Look, I swear a little bit for sure. And I don't care if my kids swear, my older kids, you get like 13, 15, whatever. Just be careful you swear around, right? I'm not really, I just don't want my little swearing. That's crazy to me. These kids have no boundaries. He's what? just, he's rolling down the, he's rolling down the. <laughs> well, okay. You need a spare outfit for your backpack. They're just laughing about it. Carry on just in case, like, I don't know, you something. spill something or a kid throws up on you hey, or whatever happens when you are traveling with 12 kids. And then you maybe they wouldn't throw up if you just fed them some healthy alternatives to the bullshit that you feed them. I don't know, maybe not. Need an outfit for Saturday evening where we're just like lounging around. Are we lounging around on Saturday evening? You are. Yes. Yeah. What? I'm gonna take yeah. the kids and walk around and do stuff. Like what the f what? You're gonna take the kids around New York City, the most dangerous, one of the most dangerous cities in the world, without your husband. I know, I know she has security, but Josh should still probably be there just for safety. No, I know you have two security guards. You have twelve children plus another girlfriend. Maybe maybe Pam's ovaries is gonna be there. But why is Josh not doing what in the f? There's some kind of like unwritten agreement that they have or some agreement they have off camera where she's like, I'm going to do this, but I'm spending an entire day by myself. No, man. This is what families do. You're the dad, bro. You don't get to just piss off and do whatever the hell you want. What in the hell is going on here? Because Why can't I go? He said. I know you and I know that you'll need downtime or you'll get super overwhelmed and stressed out. I know you. You'll need downtime and stress out, meaning I don't want a divorce in New York. That's true. Yeah. That's true. I will hate you if you don't get me down. Oh my God, guys. You seeing this shit? She's... Oh, so this guy gets to not do anything at home ever, right? Comes home, does throws a couple bags, and then she's like, when we go to this vacation, you get your own downtime by yourself. Something, something is unwritten here. Something is unsaid. So, I, I scheduled in some downtime for you. Downtime. That's amazing, and I love you. <laughs> I feel kind of selfish now. You are selfish. What the f- Why is she drinking a Coke, then a Mountain Dew? Didn't- Ew, isn't that gross? First of all, that Coke is full of shit, and so is the Mountain Dew. I, don't, I thought she bought ginger- She bought seven cases of ginger ale the other day! Do we have any sweatshirt? Okay, the Mountain Dew was empty, the Coke was full. What's in one of those cans? Hmm? Interesting. I thought you could drink it, Alicia. Hmm, allegedly. Just so you guys are aware, <laughs> I did speak to my lawyer after I got my cease and desist. Just saying the word allegedly doesn't actually do shit for anybody. So all these YouTubers and stuff that put these like disclaimers at the beginning of their videos, like, this is not meant to, it doesn't matter. You can say allegedly every other word. It doesn't mean shit. It really doesn't. Okay, I mean, maybe for big news broadcast, you know, they're just saying allegedly. It still doesn't mean she could still be sued. Just so you guys are aware, allegedly doesn't do anything. Downstairs. Because you be allegedly, she's a Nazi who cooks meth in her basement when it's not consistent. Where's the the allegation came from? Where, right? We, we do have a sweatshirt that's packed. Oh no, just our coat. Make sure you make sure you try your phone outside. Should I pack people's sweatshirts? I did not pack people's sweatshirts. You're going to New York in December. I'd pack a sweater, maybe. I don't know. We've been packing the whole evening, night. Oh, you, you're terrible at this. Okay, I don't have 12 kids, but I know I could do this way better than you. That's ridiculous. Show you what we've done. These are the outfits for the Rockettes. Uh, I don't know. Who are the Rockettes? I need to Google this. 
Rockettes are... Rockettes are American precision dance company. Okay. Sounds... Oh, the Kickline Girls. Okay, I see, I see, I see. Are they... No. Jammies. This, I gotta oh my up. god, you're not clean enough. Don't lie. Toiletries were packed in here. I labeled everything. Oh, this is in the wrong bag. Again, why don't your kids have their own toiletry bag in their backpack? So that's Josh's hotel room. That's my hotel room. And why don't you just leave the toothbrushes in the cases? Oh my god, this is so stupid. This lady is so stupid. Okay, it's now 11.15. We are packing the tote of snacks for the trip. What a waste of money. You're going to have to pay to put that on the airplane, by the way. It's not, you don't just get to put that on, I don't think. Do you? Maybe you do. But why don't you just get... I don't understand her logic. I guess, she, you know, maybe it's because she doesn't want to go shopping while she's in New York for whatever. I'm sure there's a store you could stop at from the airport on the way over with your shuttle. Hey, I'm going to go to Walmart for half an hour, pick out some snacks. Everybody grab a snack they want. Whatever. Whatever. He's got, he's got his own vision. That makes more. Their Tetris ideas are different. <laughs> I had them like this, so you have no space. Yeah, yeah. I like... Okay. Why do you expect Josh to do anything? I like think Alex's vision better. Of course you do. Weirdo. I am I'm a Tetris master. You're not a Tetris master, dude. Hey, okay, but, he was born but. Tetris <laughs> Too many cooks in the kitchen. Okay, no way. Too many cookies in your kitchen, you mean. And then you pass Just... Get the shit where you're there. What? Um, do you want to do chips too? Or do you want to do. They are chips. Pringles are chips. Uh, yeah, so I mean, I wanted to, but that box won't fit in there. Hold on, hold on. Yeah. Oh my god, these people are dumb. Yes, no, yes. Does it matter? Make it fit. Even across the chips, so. No. It's going to create less... Take the... F, f off. Take the Nutri-Grains out of the box. They're already individually wrapped inside. Okay? Take everything else that's individually wrapped and just pile that shit in this big container. Then you save so much space, dumbass. Right, but then those one on up. Careful. Really? Don't break the fish. Careful. I'm sorry, I don't want to break the fishies. Um, muffin bites can probably fit on top of the nutrient oh, bars. Baby straws can just put light, so we'll put the, um, I hate it. <laughs> there and then put the baby straws right there. And then that's fine. The popcorners were mostly for no. me, so... Yeah, muffin bites you can take out of the box. You could have done that for the other things, too. We did it, guys. You didn't do shit, Alicia. You filmed it. We did it. It's been full of hacking. Oh, my God. So then what are we going to put in on... Oh. Wait, 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 what are we doing? This I think a bin full of snacks case. instead of a suitcase since we ran out of suitcases. Oh, yeah. Who's carrying it? You and me? It is 11.56. It sure is. <laughs> get up in two hours, but we're still not done packing. But I'm gonna end this vlog. Thank you for spending the day with me. F off. I'm gonna let you say it. Okay, I had to get through, guys. It's the worst probably snark ever. But we gotta get to the New York stuff. Another day, another day. Like we gotta catch up to what they're doing. So everybody, take a deep breath. Oh, that was shit, man. Oh my god, I can't believe how bad this stuff is and that people actually watch this. Two hours and forty-five minutes, I think it was. Two hours and twenty-four minutes of pure bullshit. Good lord, man. See, the first one got 123,000 views and the second one got 60, like, half the views because people are like, I'm not doing that again. The first, just ridiculous. She's so ridiculous. Anyway, you guys are amazing, incredible, valuable. Don't you ever damn forget it. Don't fly flare. And I'll see you tomorrow.